Hey everybody, how's it going? This is Anthony of Fun Balloon Twisted 101 and I want to give you guys a really special thanks because I now have over 1,000 subscribers. I actually passed the 1,000 mark thanks to you guys. You guys are amazing. Really appreciate it. When I started this channel, I would have never thought that would happen, but you know, it's really cool. Praise God. Okay, so what I want to show you guys how to make is this really cool butterfly on a stick. It's really cool. It flies like it's flying right at you. <laughs> Um, so special shout out to Balloon Animals channel for showing me how to um, make the um, butterfly part, it's really cool. And then I went ahead and added on a stick to it. So um, let's get started. To make this one, like I said, it takes three balloons. So I'm using all Qualitex brand balloons, size all size 260. I got a diamond clear uh, balloon, I got a pink balloon, and a pale blue balloon. You can use the colors that you want for the butterfly. Okay, so let's go ahead and um, set aside the clear balloon. And let's, um, what we want to do is um, blow up the pink and blue balloon with about a five finger tail. So let's go ahead and do that. Go ahead and tie a knot. If you're having trouble tying knots on your balloons, um, I made a video that shows, I'll teach you how to tie balloons this is the best way I know how. Um, just click on the link right here on the annotation and it'll take you right to that video. So you want a, about a five finger tail. Here's the tail and here's my five fingers. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and do that with the blue balloon also, about the same size. Doesn't have to be exact exact, but try, you know, um, it's a good idea to practice eyeballing it. Whenever you're um, blowing up a balloon, practice looking at the tail and that way you want to be able to do that and just blow up balloons by looking at it. You'll get the hang of it. You just, you just gotta develop it. You just gotta do it. Okay. Okay, so what you do is you get your balloons together and um, we're gonna do two bubbles at the same time. We want like a um, two little like one inch bubbles right here. Kind of like choke it choke it with your thumb and your finger <laughs> and then just um, twist these at the same time you try something like this okay now what we're gonna do is we're gonna do like um, flower petal twists but we did these at the same time, and we're going to do the, um, the flower petal twist at the same time on both um, balloons. So what we're going to do is we're going to bend it, and it's going to be like about, about a hands, hands width flower petal. So what we're going to do is so we're, going to, we're going to twist it right here. So I'm going to use my, my middle finger and my thumb to choke it out like that. And we're just going to twist the pink and the blue balloon at the same time. So now we have something like this. Okay. So now, now what we're going to do is we're going to flip it upside down have this okay so what we're gonna do is we're gonna probably do like a three finger about a three finger twist so you get like about three fingers and then we're gonna twist it right here okay so now you have this so you have the flower petal twist and, and those two you have the two one inch twist the flower petal twist and then on the other side we have those um, three finger twists that we did. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is, see those two little um, one inch bubbles? We're gonna have those on top like this. And we're gonna bend it. We're gonna bend the whole thing. And then um, we're gonna twist like right here. We have it lined up. We have it lined up so that, so that part is with this part. We're going to like 
See if I can show you this. Show you guys this. See what we want to do is we want to twist it all right here, all this together. So it's like right here. Twist all that together. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hold it all, hold everything. Here's the other side of it. I'm holding all this stuff, all this and all this, holding it together. And then these two right here, these two right here, we're gonna twist them. So I'm twisting the upper part right here. Going like that, twisting it. So now we have this. So we have the right that, there's two little and one inch bubbles in the back. We have these in the front. Okay, um what you want to do, it's up to you, but like you want to decide like one of these one inch bubbles, you want it to be on the bottom. You can choose either one you want. Choose one of these bubbles and put it slide it to the bottom. You got one in the back, you got one on the bottom, like that. Okay, go ahead and turn it around this way. Okay, for this front part, we want to switch them over. You want We want the blue one on the pink side and the pink one on the blue side. So I'm going to take these and I'm going to switch them over. Just like that. So see, now we got the pink, the pink one on the blue side and the blue one on the pink side. Just like that. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna make the antenna. I'm gonna, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pinch the tip of it like that, and there's like a little space right there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stretch it out. I'm gonna stretch it out like this, so it's kinda tight, so it's kinda tight. And then um, this air right here, I'm gonna squeeze it. I'm gonna squeeze it, and, the air, and some air's gonna go up to the top, and it's gonna fill up this little bubble right here, and that's gonna be our, our little antenna. So hold it. So hold it up, and now this part, squeeze. Sometimes there's like a little, a little bit of a nipple right there. I don't know if you can see that. So what I'll do, I'll just kind of like keep it pinched, and just kind of like squeeze it up to the top like that. And then I'll just kind of gradually just let, let it go like that. Just, just pinch it and then gradually just let it go. Okay, so we got one. Now let's do the, the other. Let's do the blue side. So we're gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna pinch it. There's like a little bit of space right there. I'm gonna grab the the blue bubble, stretch it out, stretch it out. And this blue part just squeeze, and the air will go up to the top, and it'll start to fill this part up. And then you just kind of gradually just let it go like that a little bit. Gradually, just ever so slightly, just let it, some air go in, and the air will go up to here. It takes practice because you get the hang of it. Gradually, just gradually, let go of it like that. Okay, go ahead and um, position everything. So we're just everything's pretty much in, in place. We got one little bubble in the back. We got one little bubble in the bottom. And we just try to kind of like position these guys. Like that. And then for these loops, what you want to do is you want to like, we want them to be more of a square shape. So we're going to kind of like shape them, shape them with our hands. Kind of like get a square shape and kind of squeeze it. Helps get that square shape going. 
do the same on this side. See how it's rounded? What we're going to do is kind of like use our thumbs and just kind of push down with our thumbs like that. And then we have our middle fingers like that. We go like that. Like that. And then we have it like that and we kind of squeeze it. Kind of squeeze it. And help get that square shape going. And then we have... So go ahead and set aside the butterfly and go get your um, clear balloon. Go ahead and fill it up with air and you want about a, um, a four finger tail on it. Go ahead and tie a knot. So what you want to do is you want to, um, about ten fingers down, about ten fingers down from this point. So what I'm going to do is put my thumb right here. Hold it like that, and then right here, we're gonna do a twist. Go ahead and put your thumb, line it up right here with the tail, right here at the bottom. Boom, like that, and then your other hand, and then right here. Go ahead and make a like twist right there. So you have this, and then above that twist, we're gonna do another one, just like a uh, couple fingers, couple fingers right here. So we have that. What we're going to do is hold it down like this. And then we're going to do a pinch twist right here. So we'll go ahead and hold it. And in this bubble, we're going to pull it up just a little bit and twist it. We have this. Okay? Like the number seven, kind of. Okay, so we, this is the back of the butterfly. And we have the tail, the clear tail right here. So we're gonna like put it right here. And we're just gonna stretch out the tail and just kinda wrap it around. Kind of wrap like stretch it out and just wrap it around. Randomly however you want. And then you could just tuck it in just the back of the balloon again. Kind of tuck it in. Kind of straighten everything out. And there you have it. Alright, so this is Anthony, Fun Balloon Twisting 101. Hope you guys like this, it's really cool. And uh, thanks again so much, guys. Over a thousand subscribers now. Who would have thunk it, huh? Alright, late, peace, God bless, boom. I'm going to show you guys how to make a really cool, really exciting monkey bracelet. Check it out. It only takes one balloon. He has a cute little face, has a curly tail, has a little tongue right there. <laughs> it's really cool. It's just one balloon. So uh, it's really fun. Let's get started.